Now he lands at the intersection between bad and wrong. Ah. Ought to be a core down one of these twisted streets. But which one? He heads for the squirt steps. Won't be no field trip this time. Kid ain't ever seen an elephant squirt before. Hopes he'll never see one again. say even the most rambunctious squirts can be tamed. Squirts don't make the best of friends, but they can be useful in a pinch. No sign of the core here. At least the kid got something for his trouble. Come back and digest just about anything. Except for this. It's quick for slicing and light enough to throw. Them squirts just don't know when to quit. He heads for the east side, where windbags used to keep the local forge. Somehow that old forge is still standing. Inside the forge, he can fine-tune those instruments of his. bad for all those bullets. His bow's looking lean and mean like a prize fighter. It won't get cold around here with that thing around. A sail hammer's only as strong as its spine. That's a strong spine. Core ain't here neither, so he's gotta guess again. Place to find the likes of Percy the Snitch. Never much cared for that big wide grin of his. The rest of the path is gone for good, and his city crest won't bring it back. Heads for the biggest dump in town, Scumbag Alley. Some scumbag still feeding off the city's own trash. And there he is, the oldest scumbag of them all, Gershel. The calamity ain't done much for Gershel's sunny disposition. Fellas all dress alike. Kids wondering the same thing. And there it is. But it's locked down tight in an alloy cage. A blue 
blustery old foreman is keeping his fellas in check, almost like he's showboating for the crowd. And now there's a new marshal in town. He hears the whole place groan, but it's too tough to fall. The kid's ready to go, and his ticket out's right where he started. He comes back, just like I knew he would. The core hums in his pack. The monument's calling for it. Kid does it again. Only fair he decides what we build next. The bastion's a place of peace, but we can hold our own if we have to. Wouldn't have thought to bring a bellows to a shootout, but it just might work. The windbags used to be alright, then the calamity took the floor out from under him. Picked up traces of other cores while the kid was out. used to walk the sundown path. Kid ain't here for pleasure though. But then, somebody gets to the core before the kid. The floor starts giving way under the lightest step. A single panic squirt could bring the whole place down. Fragments of the old world rain in the sky. Stray valuables are lying everywhere. The calamity changed everything, even when the wind blows. Well, if we mastered the winds in the old days, we could do it again. But the question is, who else could have taken the core? He's wise to toss those things plenty far away. Well, ain't no survivor stole the thing. Scumbag ate it by mistake. Tough break. Unlike the kid. 